Let's look at how to configure a static IP address on a Windows 7 machine. So I have a Windows 7 machine right here. And what I need to do to configure a static IP address is first I go to the control panel. Um, I like to change it from category to large icons. If it's in category view, it looks like this. Large icons, it looks this way. Um, and then in here, you need to find the network and sharing center. From here, you can click on the adapter. And if the adapter is disabled, you would need to go to change adapter settings and you'll see it right here. So it's not disabled, but I can click on it, right click and go down to properties. For the IPv4 address, I click on IPv4, then properties. And here I can set the static IP address. So I'll set mine to 10.23.150.3. You set the mask, unless defined by whatever your network is set to, and your gateway. Uh, then you need to set your DNS. So I'm going to use Google's default DNS. And at this point, I click OK. And it will automatically set it up. And it should start checking to see if everything's working properly. Um, I can then go to my command prompt, CMD, and test it by typing ping google.com. And you can see that I am able to connect to Google. And that's how you configure a static IP address on Windows 7.